Yo, what is up? Today I'll be showing you my experience from getting all the snipers from Weston to Forge in Modern Warfare 3. The snipers this year are... Yeah. They are. They are. They are. If you want to know my reasoning, stick around. And if not, oh God. happy holidays. I'll catch you next time. Now, we would start off with the cap, but I did get a gold before I even started recording this video. So let's go to the KB. Now, the KV inhibitor is a solid gun. I honestly thought this one was going to be my favorite out of all of them. But at the end of the day, it just didn't give me that tingling sensation at the bottom of my ball. It just didn't feel as satisfying getting kills with this thing. I don't know why. All right, now the longbow is definitely one of the funnest snipers to use. That joint got a quick ADS and a big old mag. I'm talking about 30 rounds. I ain't even used half the clip before I died. Only drawbacks that I had on this was me personally, it gave me marksman rifle vibes, but not a bad gun at all. Look at this, look at this gold right here. Good Lord. Now for the X-Star. Now this was my bread and butter, baby. Fast ADS with the sensation of cocking back that bolt. Oh my. The only drawback is why why the fuck does this thing zoom in so much? I could literally see up the enemy's nose with this scope. We got that boy gold though, without a doubt. Let's look at that bad boy. Oh lord. Now for the Forge Longbow, it's probably the easiest one out of all of them. Literally 25 kills fully loaded. So that means five attachments equipped on your class. Why did I just say equip like that? That means five attachments equipped on your gun while ADSing. Look at that Longbow. Jesus. Get a cream. No, stop. Now for the cat AMR. Oh my god, this one was a whole different. You need to get 15 penetration kills. I struggled until I finally realized that this meat in the middle of meat counts as a penetration kill. Boy, I was like a prime Rocky in this shit, just beating my meat. Look at this. Oh my god. Hey, if you need a spot meat right in the middle of the map, this is where you get those penetration kills. Look at me go. Look at me go. I switched it out to a red dot. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. This was kind of hard to do, but once I got into the groove, it came easy. And then for the final one right here, through the cement, bang. You should see yourself. Now let's see this bad boy. Jeez. It joined long. All right, forged KV inhibitor. 25 headshot, plain and simple. You know, it still blows my mind that this wasn't my favorite. I was so sure that this one was gonna be my favorite. I just could not find a class setup that would work for me. Either I felt like it was too slow, quick scoping, and then I would make, you know, a class to just hard scope with, but it just, I swear, it just, I didn't get that. I didn't get that satisfying feeling, you know? That's a good gun though, don't get me wrong. Boom, look at that forward. That joint went noise. Now for the XRK. Three kills, one mag, ten times. Plain and simple. There, these all, these, all these. Uh, what, 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 what? All of these challenges are pretty simple, I'm not gonna lie. They're all fairly easy. They're all fairly easy. What game modes have you guys been playing to get these challenges? I've been doing 12v12 and that joint is low-key amazing. Going back to 6v6, it feels so slow, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not doing shipment though, hell no. That is literally brain rottening. But boom, there it is, forged. XR. And there you go, all snipers forged, baby. Now this is an interesting class. The cat, love it, little too slow. The XR, probably my favorite out of all of them. Inhibitor, now that one's cool, but it just didn't scratch that itch for me. And then the longbow, fun as hell. Just reminds me too much of a marksman rifle in my opinion. Overall, fun ass class to do. Now we move on to either the pistols or the marksman rifles. I'm not sure yet. Hope you enjoyed and I'll catch y'all later. Peace.